Hello YouTube, this is 3 Digital Cinema here, and I am making my first tutorial on how to render as PNG sequence. If you don't know what that means, that means um, when it's a video with no background, I'm just going to set up a just a sample scene right now. Let's do, uh, I'll just do 3 Digital. Just make it look at least halfway decent. Um, I use most wasted for my three digital. I don't know why I just do. Can add some caps. Let's add a material to this. Double click on that. We'll make it green. Just add some reflection. Something basic. Alright, now we gotta make an animation. So I'll just do 30 frames so it's a quick render. Or maybe 40 frames, my bad. And I'll do from here. I'll just make it spin. I'll do 360 and it spins that way whatever it's good enough <laughs> and this is what you do you go to output do this to 1280 the width the height is 720 and current frame do all frames Save, this doesn't matter, just save it to your desktop. Go to QuickTime Movie, format as QuickTime Movie, click Options, Cl click on Compression Type and do PNG, click OK. Then check Alpha Channel, that's important. You have to click check Alpha Channel. Then just do this best, make this 6 to 6 just so it renders a little faster and you can add a global illumination but I'm not going to do that for now because it'll take too long just render this real quick and I'll open up with After Effects this is so you can put like textures in the background of your videos and flares behind the text and stuff like that you know what I mean. Alright, it's almost done rendering. Okay. Here's our video right here. Wait for After Effects to open up. Just so I can show you that there's no background to it. Okay, just go to File, New, Project, Composition, New Composition. Go to File, Import. You have to import it, you can't just drag it in. Then we will import this video. Click OK. Then there's the video right here. Just show you there's no background, I'll get a texture. We'll do a matrix. I'll put this down below. There you go. See how it's behind the text? And that's how you render as PNG sequence. Hope you guys liked my first tutorial. If you want me to do more tutorials, please comment below and have a good day.